What's up, Zombie Slayers? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my 7 Days of Die single player Let's Play. This is episode 59. I had some audio sync issues at the beginning of this episode, so I'm doing a little post commentary intro. So, um, yeah, enjoy the video. So, I haven't dug that much. By the way, I came across some, uh, some iron and stuff. I haven't gone that far, but I'm going to keep going uh, quite a bit. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up top, and I'm going to kind of get an idea of how far I'm going to need to go, because I don't want to go any farther than I have to. Um, I went ahead and made, made a bunch of glass. I've also got a bunch of stuff cooking up in there. You know the drill. Um, I also have all the glass I can possibly carry, along with all the cloth fragments, glue, uh, a beaker, and I think that's about all I need. Yeah, and the bones. So you know where I'm going with this. I'm going to be making some uh, duct tape. The reason I'm going to be making duct tape is because I want to start making exp Explosive arrow, explosive crossbow bolts. These things are awesome. Okay, but we need um, we need quite a bit of duct tape for them. So that's what we're going to be doing. We're going to be going back to the other base, and we're going to get some water, and uh, that's going to be that. Um, I did I did uh, do a little bit of work on the tower in between videos, and that's that. So okay, so the the screamers seem to be spawning in uh, in my base because they are spawning in a circumference around the. The forges that I put down. Now my forges are, I believe, are about 25 or 25 blocks away or something like that. Um, and but the screamers are spawning in my base. Now they've spawned. I've seen them spawn as far in my base as over here. That was the farthest scream I've ever seen. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to count really quickly. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna sit through this. You know, I'm not going to take a long time for this, but I'm going to count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, oh, so that's about 10 blocks. 10 blocks, okay? So, what? this is what I'm thinking. I'm thinking if I move the forges down 10 blocks, hopefully the screamers won't be spawning in my base. Now, 10 blocks is the closest one, is the farthest one I've seen spawn. I've never seen any spawn over here at all. Uh, so, I'm thinking 10 blocks will probably be good enough. I'm going to go another... 15 to 25 blocks. Um, oh, look at this. It is two days before the uh, before the horde. So here come the dogs. Anyway, um... Oh, boy, the horde's coming. <laughs> anyway, I think we're okay. We're going to stick with the plan. So I'm thinking... All right, so 10 blocks, I'll probably be clear. I'm going to go about 15, possibly 20 blocks and replace my forges. Um, I just don't want screamers spawning in my base. It's a real bummer. I know it's a lot. Of, it's going to be a lot of work, but, you know, uh, what else do I have to do? Um... You know, and you guys are going to sit with me through some of it. Uh, I'll probably do some time lapses. Uh, maybe I'll maybe I'll write down some topics to talk about. Who knows? I'll, I'll try and find something to make it interesting. But uh, it is what it is. It gots to be done. Oh, boy. I'm not... I am not sure about the bars on this base. Um, in case you don't know, those bars only have a 1,000 hit points. I think the bars were a mistake. I mentioned this last video. I'm going to mention it again. I think the bars were a mistake. Um, okay, my guess is 100%. Even, I never filled it up. I think there's a bug or something. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw out half my... Not half, I'm going to throw out like... Uh, uh, 344 guess, just to make up for that guess that I believe is bugged. So, oh, this thing, this thing still uh, needs to be repaired quite a bit. Come on, get on the freaking thing correctly, man. There you go. Nope, that's not... There you go. Yeah, we need to repair this thing. We need to build this thing properly. We need to put a, possibly a better battery in it. Um, and we definitely need to... Uh, we definitely need to um, take it apart and make a better chassis for it. You know, uh, I am not going to be using my gas for anything but traveling for now um, until I get a steady supply coming in. We do have to go to the desert at some point and uh, start on a mine. I'll probably do that after the, 60, the Day 63 horde. Um, because I'm just too busy doing other things right now. I was also going to make the explosive bolts this episode, but I can't. Oh, man, I screwed up. Uh, how far am I? Yeah, let's go back. Alright. Anyway, I'm, I was going to make the explosive bolts, and I can't. And I'll tell you why I'm going back in a moment. Um, I can't because... That's it. That would make, make a good mine right there. Um, why? Oh yeah, because I don't have any. I don't have enough cloth. I have been ignoring cloth the whole game, and I am now paying for it. I should have gotten a cotton farm up a long time ago, uh, because I only have about 20, 26 cloth or something like that. Um, where is my farm? Uh, 
Hold on, let me see if I can see it on the map. Did I not mark my farm or is it over here? Well, let's take a look really quick. I did mark it, didn't I? Yep, there it is. No, that's a tree farm. No, I never marked my farm. That's right, the farm is actually inside the, the town. Oopsie. Okay. That's alright. We're just going to go right to it. We're not going to pick anything. I know there's stuff to be picked. Actually, we are going to pick stuff because we need to make room for the for the cotton seeds. These cotton seeds really need to be uh, put down. Ah, oh, damn it. Alright, corn. Eh, let's just do this. Now that we found a desert, we're going to be able to get shale. Uh, corn is not as big of a deal anymore. Some people were also commenting that I could make much better food. And that is true. It's just, you know, it's a time thing. I just, it's a time management thing. I just don't think making that better food is that big of a deal. Um, I've got 176 wellness. I mean, really, what do I need? I mean, how much wellness does one person need? I don't really think it's a big deal right now. Um, yeah, so anyway, another thing we could do in the other town uh, to get cloth is we can tear down um, the, the curtains, which we will do. Uh, and while I'm there, I'm also gonna, I'm also going to get some brass. Because I have not been getting brass, and my brass supplies are getting quite low. Uh, yeah, so brass and uh, curtains. Yeah, brass and curtains. And we gotta get water. And we gotta, we gotta take the water. We gotta, I think, you actually need, um, clean water for the, for the glue, don't you? Hmm. Why would you need clean water for glue? Like, does it really matter? I mean, it's not like you're drinking it. But, what we'll do is we'll go we'll grab the water, we'll go downstairs, we'll start up the fires, um, get some water boiling, and then I will go back out and we'll get the brass and the... And the cloth. We're also going to end the, the day. Oh man, we don't have any room to carry anything. Cause it, but why does water stack in 15 anyway? Like, can, can you give us at least 30 or something? Because like, fifth, only 15 jars at a time is a real bummer. But anyway, we're also going to, uh, we're also going to farm throughout the night. We're looking for coal and potassium nitrate. Um, and I'm going to have a hard time bringing everything back. Although I do have a basket on the back of this thing, which is nice. So I think we're looking pretty good now. Man, that horde's going to be something. I don't like... I know I've mentioned this, but man, those iron bars are really worrying me. The 63-day horde might uh, get me to replace those iron bars with, with concrete. I just... The iron bars on the bottom, um, I just don't think are worth it. Because I should probably kill that animal. Yeah, I need the... Because if I'm making new forges, I'm going to need more more hide. Gotcha, sucker. Oh, we got too much stuff on us. Let's throw some jars in the back of this thing. Come on. Okay. If the mini bike goes underground, the jars are the last thing I care about. Someone else said, why do I keep throwing away my jars? They're so important. Well, I found a desert biome. Like, <laughs> at that point, jars are a joke. So. All right. Put you guys in there. Take you guys back. Uh, let's put those in there. Anything else I don't care if I'm going to lose? Not really. Let's go ahead and grab some snacks. Eat us up some yucca fruit. I love this yucca fruit, man. This stuff's so so good. It, I mean, it doesn't give you a lot of a lot of fullness back, but it's still awesome. And I think when I go when I go back to the uh, to the desert biome, I might actually take some time and knock down some more cactuses again. Not so much for the fruit, but more for the. Uh, um, I actually need more plant fibers. Believe it or not. All right, I have completely gotten lost in here. I'm going over here. You know what? I'm not going to keep my... Uh, I'm going to put my... My bike where I normally put it. Because I do not want it by the mine. Because with the mine going... Um, there's a good chance that hordes are going to be coming in. So let's put the bike over here. Next to our original home. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Feels like we're back home again, guys, huh?
Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna definitely move those forges away because. Uh, what do you think? You think twelve spots would be enough? Like, I mean, I counted. You saw me count, and that's the closest I've ever seen a a screamer spawn. And I'm pretty sure if they spawned farther away, they would make it to me. I would have seen one by now. And I mean, I mean, come on, how how like big could their circumference be of like where they spawn? I mean, it's it's already ridiculous. I mean, they're spawning a good 35 blocks, 40 blocks away from the forges. That's that's insane. So, I don't think it'd be much bigger than that. I'll probably go 20 blocks out and then make my new forge room. Eh, paper's not really that big of a deal anymore. I mean, it is, but it's nothing I'm going to get upset about. I mean, this was a much better defense for the Screamers. How come the Screamers didn't spawn inside that house? Probably because, um... There's not a lot of room in there. Maybe, you know, it's, I just got lucky, I guess. It's not a very big house. There we go. All right, guys, I went back and got the water. <laughs> yeah, I just totally forgot. All right, so, all right, here's the thing about the infinite water source. I don't mind going out and getting my own water. Um, I think it's part of the survival aspect of the game. Um, and I don't really mind it, but what I do hate about it is these these bottles only stacking in 15. Like, that's really annoying. So, you know, if the bottles stacked a little bit more reasonably, I would, uh, I'd be okay with it. And I know in real life, yes, I would not be able to carry more than 15 bottles, yada, yada, yada. I get that. But in real life, I wouldn't be able to carry, you know, 100 things, 500 logs either. So let's not let's not play the um, let's not play the realism game on this. Fact of the matter is, water only stacks in fifteen. And it's really annoying. Um, so I am going to actually learn that trick. But here's the thing: I have to learn the trick. Can anybody tell me how to do it? Like, how do I get infinite water source? Like, how deep? How what? How like? What are the dimensions? Like, how how far? Like, you know, three by three, five by five, and how deep? If anyone can tell me, please. Let me know, because I am going to do the infinite water trick, because uh, this, I don't mind going to get my own water, but come on, man, this is ridiculous, like, it's too, it's, it's no good, no bueno. Um, yeah, you know what, you can't cook that much anyway, Cage. You can only cook, what, uh, 95 at a time or something like that? What did we figure? I don't know. Uh, let's just do 80 at a time. Wait, what am I doing? Oh, I don't have a pot. I never brought a pot. Okay, cooking pot. Boom. Craft. I'm going to leave a couple things up here. And if I forget them here, you know, it's not really the end of the world. Well, maybe just one thing. Alright. Oh, you know what? We're going to need another cooking pot, aren't we? I want to get two of these things going at once. Each one can, uh... Each one can hold, uh, 90... Can make 90, uh, jars. Wood in there. A little more should do it. All right, let's get some of these jars done. I want to go up. I want to go up top and get some cloth. We're gonna mine the crap out of this place at night, and also uh, we're just gonna we're gonna melt down all those bones uh, into glue, and also make as many uh, as much duct tape as we can. All right, what I say: 95, 15, 30, 60, 75, 85, 90. That is right. So 90. Cook. I'm not gonna need all that wood in there. There you go. Alright. Let's get our second cooking pot up and let's go up top and get some get some uh get some cloth. You know, you guys should really get your cloth farms going early. Like don't like don't get caught like I did because that is not good. Uh off, take the wood, let's go. I should have left some basic supplies here. I don't, I don't know. I knew I'd come back because I, I knew that where I was going, there wouldn't be any uh, potassium nitrate or coal. So I'd have to eventually come back here. So I don't know what I was thinking. Come on, man. Damn. It takes longer to make a pot than it does 1,700 gas. Come on, man. There we go. And bottled water, 135. I don't think so. How about 90? And we need some... <laughs> what am I thinking? I'm going to cook the freaking pot. Um, no, I'm not going to cook the pot. 
Seven minutes, that's about 50. Yeah, that'll work. I always go a little over, just because, I don't know. I'm afraid that the, the forges are bugged or something. I don't know why I do it. I do it. I don't know why I do the things I do. All right. Bottled water. 90. All right, let's go up top. I'm gonna need the, the axe for that. Get some cloth. We need some cloth, my boys. And my ladies. That's not, it sounds weird. You say my ladies. Um, how about my friends? You're all my friends. How about that? That works. All right. Get on up here. Okay, so now we just gotta check houses. Although I don't wanna check around here because I'm worried about the screamers. But, oh, don't we get leather out of the couches too? We do, don't we? Yes, we do. That is good. Good stuff. Bookcase. Bookcase. Oh, there's some cloth. I'm sorry, I meant cloth, not leather. Actually, the, uh, the couches are probably better to get than the, you know, than the curtains. All right, so what are we gonna do next video? Well, next video we will be done down there. We have to transfer everything back to the house. You guys want to see that? You guys want to see me transfer everything back to the house? Or you just want me to come back when I'm at the house? You let me know. Make these videos for you guys. Actually, you know what? We're gonna get quite a bit of cloth like this. Probably don't need the. The cotton farm. I don't care. I like farms. <laughs> Big farms. Let's get the farms, you know? When in doubt, just make more farms. Stupid effing allergies. Oh, I keep forgetting to get this stuff, too. Ooh. That's not gonna work. There we go. It's unlocked, Cage. I don't care! <laughs> For those of you who haven't watched this Let's Play from the beginning, in the beginning of Let's Play, you know, I get excited in the beginning of Alphas, you know, and I'm just like, I'm not thinking straight, I'm just like, oh god, I've been playing, oh god, Alpha, Alpha, and there's so much new stuff, and I'm like, a, I'm like a kid in a candy store. And I broke open so many unlocked doors, people were just, like, going crazy, it was funny. Um, so that's what that joke was all about. Alright. Is there an upstairs? Yeah, there is. Probably won't be any couches up here. Nah, there's nothing up there. Who cares? Let's go. Look at this. We already got 69. That's so much. Alright, um, you know what? ABC. Duct tape. Duct tape is one of the things that gets uh, crafted quickly, though. But you'd be surprised what doesn't get crafted quickly, you know? So, you never know when something's gonna take a long time to craft, so you should just craft everything when you can. Whoop. There you go. Got you there, you stupid deer. I outsmarted you, you stupid deer. No deer's gonna outsmart KG48. You're gonna be a forge. Uh, what do I got on me? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's keep going. Get out of the way, you stupid tree. Yeah, the couches are definitely a way to go for cloth, actually. Cloth for days! Cloth's one of those things you really never needed that much, you know? Like, uh, us longtime players, we don't think about cloth very much. Uh, but now, that you need it for duct tape, and duct tape's huge. Duct tape should be huge. Duct tape should be the kind of thing you build in everything. I mean, really, like, think about it, man. You make anything, you're gonna be using duct tape. Look at this freaking tree. Huh. Alright, let's move on. I think someone said this stuff all gives you brass now, right? Didn't someone say that? Nope, that gives you iron. Maybe the faucets. Oh yeah, look at it. See, faucets give brass. Interesting. 
That's interesting. Which way did we come from? Crap, I don't know. We came from... Yeah, we came from over here. So we want to head this way. The only, the only downside about this town is it's full of such crappy buildings that um, not a lot of them have, you know, the couches and stuff for the cloth I'm looking for. Uh, key just keep. Memories. No, I'm not going to sing. I suck at it. All right. All right, you big douchebag. Oh, sucker! That's another thing. Someone's like, oh, you should make, uh, you should definitely be using, uh, um, steel arrowheads. Why are you a noob? Or something like that. And I'm like, well, I'd get one shot him without them, so why, why use the steel? Maybe for the cops and stuff. I will actually use steel arrowheads at some point. I'm just, I don't know. I just, the honest reason, I just haven't had time to make them. Been so busy. Alright, here we go. Come to Papa. You got more glue? Nope. How many bones do we have? Like 80 something? Honestly, it doesn't matter. We should keep getting cloth. We should get as much as we can. Alright, I'm going to ask you guys again. Please let me know in the comments because some people have been saying that I've been doing too much off-camera work and that they want to see more of the... Someone actually said they want to see more of the mining and more of the travel time. Um, let me know in the comments. Do you guys want to see me traveling back to town tomorrow? Or do you just want me to come back when I'm back in town? You let me know. I'm, I'm going to make the videos you guys want to see. But I'm also going to go with, you know, majority rules. So y Your voices will be heard, so don't uh, don't complain if it's not the video you want it to be. Unless you got outvoted, in which case I apologize. <laughs> oh, this is a crappy house. Did they nerf beer, man? It seems to be going so quickly. Got a lot of cloth. I don't know if that was unlocked or not. I don't care. I I hit the I hit the door first and ask questions later. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of this is where I roll. I don't even live here anymore, dumbasses. Is there any couches in the popping pills? You think? Probably not. How did I get in there? From the back? Yeah, I don't think there's any couches in there. Uh, yeah, there's couches in that place, but they're not the couches I'm looking for. These are not the couches I'm looking for. Well, let's see if there's some blood blood-soaked couches in here. You never know. I don't think there are. The couches in here are the black ones, and they give you leather. Now, let's just hit this place first. I know there's couches in here I, I can use. Yeah, cloth, yo. Alright, guys. I'm going to continue getting cloth until uh, nighttime. And then I'm going to actually uh, go down and I'm going to mine throughout the night and um, I'm going to work on making duct tape. And uh, like I said, leave me, leave me comments on if you want me to show you stuff like the, the ride back to town or not. So we're going to call this one here. That's going to be it for episode 59. We'll see you next time for episode 60. Till then, take it easy.